Hello everyone, my name is Shivam Singh and uh, after a long time I am just interacting to you guys. So I was not creating a video due to few reasons. Uh, I was busy somewhere else. So now I am again to create a new video for you. So I have seen lots of comments on my channel. So as like I have just posted few days back I mean I think uh, yesterday so I have promised you to create a video for a certification and uh, what kind of videos which I have done earlier so those are also pending like for example uh, Magento 2 admin knowledge Magento 2 theme miscellaneous Magento 2 backend and frontend so all those videos I will create and update uh, as soon as possible so like uh, i have discussed yesterday so on my post i have just uh, created like i will come with magento 2 certification guide which has updated so uh, for those i will explain today and uh, i will show you how can crack that certificate magento 2 certification uh, along with uh, what kind of update by Adobe Magento Commerce and uh, what kind of all those things uh, uh, has changed. So uh, we are just going to check for those. So here I can write here Adobe Certification Learning. So uh, you should click on the first URL. <coughs> So uh, here we have a different kind of Adobe certification and different kind of label. So Adobe qualified, uh, it will uh, approx needed minimum six to twelve months. So an Adobe certified professional, Adobe certified expert, Adobe certified master, and corresponding uh, minimum number of experience needed. So uh, I will just go through their Adobe certification uh, here itself for view adobe certified professional so today i will only talking about adobe commerce ad0 e717 it is nothing but if you are just coming to this page this is a adobe experience cloud certification and uh, here you can see there's two button view exam guide and about certification renewal so you can see here exam guide exam preparation portal this is for Adobe partners join now and available to all users. So here are three different kind of uh, Adobe uh, level of expertise. So first one is Adobe certified professional, Adobe certified expert and Adobe certified master. So that is uh, uh, what will be the criteria and how I will how, how I will give and uh, what will be the minimum number of experience or maximum number of experience. So what you should to do you can read all these things from here itself and uh, if you want to give for going for certification you should go in the commerce tab here you will click then you will show three different uh, certification level the first one is adobe certified professional that is for basic level uh, it will be for uh, beginners yeah and you can see here the number of uh, experiences needed for that so it will be only for minimum 0 to 12 months so here also for professional it will be a three different type like business part partitioner and developer with cloud add-on and front-end so for uh, adobe certified expert business partitioner ad0 e708 developer with cloud add-on so that will be for adobe certified expert and uh, last one is adobe certified master so it will be for architect level so uh, i will only focus on adobe certified professional and i will give the brief idea about each and everything how we can do that how we can start how you should prepare for that exam so that we need uh, how we can do all these things i will let you know in upcoming videos but uh, i will only show you here where uh, we can check all these details from the dev docs so i will when i will click here then uh, you will redirect on uh, exam preparation guide adobe commerce developer professional certification 
so here is the introduction things you can read all these things so exam guide section so minimum candidate experience indent which i have already told you exam information exam objective and scope readiness and self assessment sample question and how to prepare the exam so next one is minimum candidate experience so as i have already told you uh, and i have already uh, show you how and uh, exam information it is just like exam number that is code ad0e717 which has updated in 30 december 2022 so today is uh, 25 february right so exam number exam exam name adobe commerce developer certification level certified professional status active english will be compulsory for this and number of question will be 77 duration 154 minute and multiple choice and multiple select options delivery online protocol passing marks out of 70 77 at least 50 marks should be there and the, the price we can see like for usd for uh, india it will be a 95 dollar for other country it will be more than uh, 30 so more 30 prices so here for other countries apart from india 125 dollar so we can schedule our exam to click here and uh, here i can see the <clears throat> what kind of uh, uh, syllabus here so we can see here section one which will cover five percent of working with admin so here all these things you can see and check out section two architect level that will cover 29 percent of syllabus section three eav database which will uh, uh, kept 13 percent Apart from that, layout and UI 15%, and checkout and sales it will take 8%, catalog 8%. Now, section 7, 8, section 8, and section 9, these all are cloud add on. Again, I'm saying these section 7, section 8, and section 9, these are not uh, there for uh, on earlier version. So, Section 7 is Adobe Commerce Cloud Architecture and Section 8 Setup Configure Adobe Commerce Cloud and Section 9 it will consider Commerce Cloud CLI tool it will consider 6% of the syllabus. So overall approx 12 for 16 and 16 plus 6 22 percent will count 22 uh, percent will include uh, for cloud itself. So that will be a major portion and so many beginners are uh, not ready for it because uh, earlier version ad0 e7 double uh, one so that was not included uh, those cloud things so i will help you how we can crack that exam okay so on the next video i will check each and everything on a break thank you so much